Hi fellas, just wanted to show you my new Cobra XPS 6700. It's a lovely uh, radar laser detector, dash detector, fully legal in the UK and USA. I think in Virginia and America and US air bases, the, the more or less banned. Uh, I got this for a song. I don't think it's the very latest model. I think they've moved on to the Rad 350 and the IRAD. Uh, but this is a typical example of a well presented, very effective, very sensitive radar laser detector at not ridiculous prices. I mean, if you look on uh, on YouTube especially and on eBay and what have you, you will see, especially eBay, is riddled with Cobra fakes from anything from $8 to $50. To $50. I'll shut up a second. Here we go. There's the distance things. Didn't mean to switch it on then, but as you see, extensive bands. System ready. System ready. Uh, when it comes out of the box, um, obviously you've got... You got, you got Got these different, you know, these, dark, bright. these different features. Highway. You can see highway city and what have you. Here we go. And put everything on. Just keep pressing. City X K K A. And laser alerts are always uh, permanently switched on. I'll just uh, just like to say well done to our our England football team. Uh, it's looking like it, it could be our golden year and if it matches up with us leaving the EU that'll suit me fine so well done boys keep it up uh, we're at the top of our group and we've only got the final to go so um, as you see it has been quite hot today capital radio 27.5 in the shade it's been 30 degrees all day <laughs> so uh, makes it a bit oppressive to do any outdoor work um, I'm heavily suntanned now even with sun cream on um, I actually my skin tone is something like an Indian an Indian guy now <laughs> although I am white European um, now as we see it's a lovely unit I got brought me radar, uh, my um, laser range finder with me and this is ideal for use with my Hammond enclosure it's an alloy enclosure the circuit board in here with my jammers uh, now these are a lot simpler than, and certainly a great deal, about a tenth the cost of sun jammers, but they are handmade uh, in the UK by myself. They are effective and they are truly agilient. Agilent. And what does this mean? Well, all, all jammers, whether it be a blind or an ALP, are what is termed oscillator jammers. The only difference being now is a few of them are updatable, so they can, you know, they can alter the, the pre plugged pre-programmed frequency to try and outwit the latest to try and continue confusing the latest vpr or you know what have you dragon eye guns the difference being of course this doesn't need updating because whatever signal hits it it alters the timing you know introduces you know a different signal pattern and is returned to the using an Osram laser, an Osram 75 watt capable laser. It is returned to the police laser gun, so which is very, very confusing, believe you me. Um, but is a all you need to do with this is to connect it to the power supply, ignition on power supply. On this card, there's a fuse box just over on the left hand side. Uh, you can you can actually put it into the into the fuse blade, but using a piggyback fuse is better, of course. You can also uh, since this doesn't have an automatic switch off, you, you can also take a feed from the internal fuse box, which is usually under the glove box, um, and uh, just run one little hole, run it to a switch, like under here somewhere, and a simple little, you know, one dollar switch, and then run one live to this unit, and of course the black goes to ground, earth, as we call it here, um, or chassis. So, as you see, it has been quite hot today. It's um, it's quite a relief actually. It reminds me of my time in Africa and Turkey. Um, it really, you know, it's so bloody hot. And unless you've got your aircon on, you're sweating like pigs, and it's very hard to get anything done. So there's a woman staring at me. Hmm. Thinks I'm talking to myself, probably. <laughs> uh, yeah. So anyway, I brought along my my uh, laser range finder. Of course, in America, they're still clinging on. A couple of states are still clinging on to KA. Um, radar guns, KA radar guns uh, are on their way out rapidly because 
there's rumours, call it what you will, that they can give policemen testicular cancer. We can imagine with the lawsuits, the potential lawsuits, there's already a few cops being paid two or three million dollars. So I just want to, in, in most, probably 80% speeding tickets now in the USA and probably 90% in Europe, excluding kind of automated GATSOs, polyscans, are using laser. And as you see, it's most important that it's sensitive. Let me check, are we ready? Yes. Laser alert. Quite a peculiar signal on this. So I've shown this late, this exact laser range finder signal on my scope. It's in groups of kind of 50, 100 pulses. That's not a maximum volume, by the way. Of course, I could turn it up. Yeah, there we go. Very effective. And, and uh, we don't tell you, but it's got the voice alert on these cobras, just like on these. These six hundred dollar Unidens and V1s and Red Densos that these salesmen in the UK and America get for like twenty five dollars, including tax, and bang out, sell, rip off customers for five, six, seven hundred dollars. I mean, are they real? I mean, if, it happens. If you want to buy a, t a nice toy for your car, I mean, whether these protect you or not, no, I don't think they really do. Um, I can only think I use one regularly. Um, I can only think of one occasion when I believe I did pick up a faint reflection off a speed cop. Having said that, that one time I picked the reflection up, I did actually slow down just in case, and lo and behold, he was there. He was there. So, um, that's it. So, here we go. So here. Anyway, so as you see, this, this signal, this signal rangefinder is actually quite similar to the, um, to the. Pro Laser 4, Laser alert. Just, just a little bit faster, but uh, I'll call that a day. Um, if you're interested in a simpler, agilent, handmade uh, laser jammer, I do this one and a, and a silver variant. This is kind of my favourite to be honest because you can put this in your grill and it doesn't need, and use one of these, and you don't need to go through what we call a bulkhead, the firewall, and getting through the firewall unless you can find a, a you know unless you're experienced enough to know where the grommets are uh, running a wire through a grommet is very easy but finding the grommets and peeling the sealant off them can be quite a job you might have to call people in so i would recommend fit, fitting this through a small switch down here perhaps down here anywhere you could even use it in some cars you even have redundant switches like this one you could actually get your friend to do that and use one of these a nice genuine cobra not a fake not an alibaba not an ebay not a rip-off v1 or uniden or a denso and you will get good alerts um this is an mpv i've reached that time in life when i've had to give up the subaru, subaru wrx's and the salikas and the v6 old capris and and these 140 the, what was it the two liter 140 mile 145 mile an hour one day old gear we used to have that two litre um i've had to give it up because of children yes because i'm a regular partner and i have several children who i'm very proud of and, and the adorable kids um nothing matters more to me in my own character in my own heart than my kids future talking about kids future i just wanted to show you my attitude a lot of you guys my attitude and my view i was an ex i was a, a great campaigner for uh, brexit uh, my my family i mean some of you guys already know my surname my family family's name comes from service to the king i just wanted to show you my own personal statement that we have the old you know some people think it's silly i just wanted to show you my my own personal opinion about the eu the anti-democratic eu can you read that Police have looked at me a few times, but it doesn't say, you know, FCK or screw. It says stuff, which is relatively polite. And especially all the people that want to keep us in, who are earning like 100,000 plus, like the police commissioners, the policemen are earning 50 grand a year, the social workers are earning 60 grand a year. They don't care if our kids are getting groomed, if our working class kids are getting abused and raped all over the country. They don't care. 
they don't care, they're paying for their mortgage. They've got their lovely Audi. But us ordinary dads, us ordinary mums, Tommy Robinson, and a few, and probably over half, half the population of the UK do care very much. We do care very much. You know, well, we're not racist, we don't mind immigrants, we've never minded immigrants in the 1960s, that's fine. But what we don't need is disrespectful, arrogant, master race Islamic people. Because that's what they are. If you look into the Quran and you look into Islam, it's pure. It's, it's, like, it's like a worse version of Adolf Hitler's regime. So anyway, that's my view. If you like it all on it, I don't care. But that's my view and that's what I campaign for. And that's what I'm still campaigning for. But as far as Lazy Jammer is concerned, if you want a Lazy Jammer for about eight, an eighth or a tenth of the cost of these these expensive multi-head you you know low-powered led multi-head units um by all means contact me um or i can take the option of buying and you know an alp or a stingo what have you have a good good quality led jammer so that's my quick rundown and my quick plug for my products uh, as i say if if you don't totally like this one there's a very similar looking uh, i think it's the xps cobra xps 6 600 and there's a couple of videos uh, American guys have put on, and that's really cool. I kind of, I'm going to get one of them as well. They're so reasonable. I mean, <laughs> when you consider, if you're looking at a laser jammer, whichever make, you know, uh, an updatable ALP or blinder or a three thousand dollar stinger, a la any laser jammer, current laser jammer, bar bar mine, what has it inside it? It's got a detection circuit very much like this, which I paid about fifty quid for. 50 pounds about 55 60 dollars now since the pounds dropped you know it's got that and it's got a few meters of extra wiring and it's got two two or three led heads led heads with ir 900 nanometer leds at a cost of kind of 50 cents a piece and there's four in each head and the alp and the blinders so how do they justify basically a 50 a 50 pound laser detection circuit a load of a load of you know alarm four core wire and two you know eight leds eight infrared leds but they want kind of fifteen hundred dollars three thousand dollars you know shouldn't the price be nearer to like three hundred dollars except for the fact that they make out are so brilliant okay see you guys a few people looking at me thinking i'm talking to myself but i'm obviously not a healthy girl. Right, see you guys. Bye bye.